Hey YouTube, this is Hair Attic 5. I recorded a video earlier today and it was really rough. I don't know if I was speaking clearly. I don't know if you guys could hear me. My hair wasn't combed and I promised that I would come back and do this right. So, I'm pretty much doing that video over. I flat ironed my hair so you guys can see what it's looking like as of now. I feel like a complete retard about my hair, let me tell you that. I did a seven month stretch. Okay, let me just be real. I was trying to go natural. I couldn't hack it. After seven months, I was like, I need a perm. Okay, so I just relaxed my hair three weeks ago and it burned so bad on the right side of my head that this side didn't get to take. Oh my goodness. So, I have straight hair, thick hair, and maybe you guys can help me out with this. I'm on this healthy hair journey, and I don't know if it would be okay for me to try to relax it again, but I'm having the hardest time styling it because one side is straight and one side is natural. <laughs> um, so, would it be completely unhealthy on my hair if... I just went back and relaxed those parts that didn't take. I don't know. Um, I'm on hair list as well. And I asked the question. They're being slow on the responses. And nobody answered my question. So if there are people that are interested in watching a newbie's video and you want to answer my question, that'd be awesome. Um, if not, like I said, I got onto the site to be able to ask questions. <laughs> Not so much to be informative or uh, teach people how to do styles or anything like that because I don't know. I am becoming a YouTube addict. I have to get on every day and learn something new and go buy a new product. I think I'm becoming a little bit of a junkie with the products. Um, I don't know. So I relaxed three weeks ago. Today was pretty cool wash day. I got all the Apple G set or whatever between $41, $45 at my local beauty supply. And I don't have the swing. I don't have the Tia swing. Where's my swing? <laughs> so I'm not happy about that. But I'm working on it. You know, like I said, it could have a lot to do with the fact that this side is not permed. Um, but I'm learning. And I'm sure I won't make that mistake again. I'm also in the process of taking the biotin, thousand dosage or milligram or I'm not sure, it says a thousand on the bottle. Um, I began to have spring allergies, started my cycle and biotin all at the same time. So when I broke out, I don't know if it's the biotin or if it's the spring weather or if it's just a month of thing. So I don't know if the pimples are from biotin, it's only been a week. So, I'll keep you guys posted on what I think about that. Let's see what else. Skin. I care about my skin. I'm trying to get clearer skin. And today I picked up something called Ambi. I don't know. I usually use Clean and Clear. It's not really doing anything. I'm not feeling clean or clear. <laughs> so, this Ambi, I only use it this morning. I'm going to use it again this evening when I, you know, wrap my hair and wash my face and brush my teeth and all that fun stuff you do at night. I'm so tired. Today is, I'm not sure the date, but it is the day before Easter. I just finished dyeing Easter eggs with my two-year-old. I got dye all over my fingers. Craziness! Um, but this is kind of a blabber. I just wanted to introduce myself because um, I don't know if I was very clear in my last video. I am from Chicago, 27 years old. I just bought my first house. Whoop, whoop. Um, I have a two-year-old going on 32, you know what I'm saying? Um, I also will probably have her on here so you guys can see the texture of her hair and people can be like, you know, telling me what I need to do because I've never been natural. And she's two, so of course she doesn't have a perm. And I don't know what to do with it. So that will definitely be something I'll be interested in knowing about on here. Uh, let's see. Favorite color is red. <laughs> um, 
yeah so I think my hair is doing really good I chopped it off summer of 2010 it was up to here in this mug short I mean short uh, I didn't have a bang at all uh, this I flat ironed my hair today so you guys can see length I don't know if you can see that I guess I'm still officially in the net club. Darn. Thought I was getting some length, but you know, in a year, it, I feel like I've come a long way. My birthday's in July. I cut my hair for my birthday, and it's in there. It's called, my pictures I posted, it's called the birthday chop. And it's really, really short, so in a year, I've come a long way. But like I said, I don't have the swing like I want in my hair and everything, so. I don't know if I'm not picking the right products. I don't know. I have so many questions. So if you guys have some input, let me know what the deal. Um, but I'm going to go because I feel like I'm just blabber, blabber, blabber. But I wanted to reintroduce myself because that first video was so rough. That video was so rough. I think it's getting diluted. I was just saying. Anyway, thank you so much for sitting here and listening to me blabber on blabber on but yeah i'm really excited about having a youtube channel so i hope you guys can help me out with this hair journey lord knows i need it <laughs> all right guys see you later